Is that true that motor graders are the hardest heavy equipment to operate part 1? Any big construction equipment, such as an excavator, backhoe loader, or motor grader, is not easy to operate. This necessitates a thorough understanding of the equipment as well as a certain skill set in order to do the jobs efficiently and accurately. Motor graders are generally regarded as the most challenging trucks to operate among all heavy equipment. This is due to the fact that they are a little different from the others in terms of setting the controls, such as the blade's angle and height, which necessitates a certain level of competence, especially when setting them to get a fine degree of result. Yes, motor graders are a little odd to run, but they aren't that difficult. Working with precision measures is a requirement for every machine, whether it's a motor grader, excavator, or backhoe loader. Good training and expertise behind the controls, as well as a comprehension of the equipment and its different pieces, are required to achieve finished results that completely match the desired level. Motor graders decoded. Motor graders are typically used for mixing concrete, placing patches, expanding shoulders, cutting back slopes, ditching, scarifying, drying material, and removing snow. Before we get into the motor grader recommendations, it's crucial to understand what a motor grader is and how it works. The purpose of a motor grader is to level or smooth out an area. They have a long wheelbase that allows them to traverse small depressions or humps. Motor graders usually have a blade in the middle that may be tilted to cast out on either side. The mold board is the portion of the grader that is used to cut, mix, windrow, and disperse material. The circular section of the motor grader, i.e., the circle, is attached to the mold board with the cutting blade. The blade may be modified for height, angle, pitch, and reverse orientation using the mold board. The blade angle is the angle of the blade in regard to the mainframe, which is usually 180 degrees or a straight line. With the frame, the mold board forms angles. For more information call 469-370-7501 or visit interstateheavyequipment.com.